The field of humanoid robotics is advancing at an unprecedented rate, with key players like Boston Dynamics and Figure AI making significant progress. However, Tesla's approach with its Optimus robot presents a fundamentally different strategy. While we have become accustomed to task-specific devices like smart speakers and robot vacuums, Elon Musk's vision for Optimus is far more ambitious. The rapid evolution from the Gen 2 prototypes to the current Gen 3 gives us a clear indication of what a next-generation model could achieve. This isn't just an incremental upgrade, it represents a potential shift toward a new category of machine, one intended to become a common household fixture. This analysis will examine the core components of Optimus's development, its AI foundation, its physical mechanics, and its connection to Tesla's manufacturing capabilities. We will break down how these elements are converging to create a potential general-purpose humanoid robot and explore the critical question, how might this technology transform the home, and what is a realistic timeline? Line for its arrival. For years, home automation has consisted of a collection of devices that operate in isolation. A smart speaker can provide information but can't perform physical tasks. A robot vacuum can clean floors but lacks the versatility to handle anything beyond its core function. These devices lack broad intelligence and most importantly, the physical form to interact with the world in a meaningful way. On the other end of the spectrum are highly agile robots like Boston Dynamics Atlas, which can perform incredible feats of parkour. These machines are physical marvels but have historically been programmed for specific routines rather than general purpose intelligence. They are athletes but not yet adaptive thinkers capable of navigating an unpredictable home environment. This is the gap Tesla aims to fill. The challenge has been to combine advanced physical dexterity with an AI that can understand and adapt to the real world. Tesla's strategy is to leverage its most advanced real-world AI, originally developed for vehicles, and give it a physical body. While Tesla has not officially designated a Gen 4 model, the progress from Gen 2 to the latest prototypes provides a blueprint for the next stage of development. The evolution is rapid with significant hardware and software updates. Let's analyze the three pillars that define the next generation Optimus. First, the AI. Optimus's intelligence is derived from the AI developed for Tesla's full self-driving FSD program. This is an AI trained on data from billions of miles driven in real-world conditions. It primarily uses a vision-based system, relying on cameras to perceive its environment, which is a key distinction from competitors that often use more complex sensors like LiDAR. This approach is designed for scalability and real-world application from the start. The architecture uses end-to-end -end neural networks works, which means the robot's goal is to learn new tasks by observing them, a process known as imitation learning. While the capability to learn thousands of tasks simply by watching a video is the long-term goal, it is not yet a fully demonstrated reality. Furthermore, there is recent confirmation that XAI's Grok will be integrated to serve as Optimus's conversational brain, which would allow for more nuanced verbal commands. Second, the body and senses. The latest Optimus prototypes are designed to operate in human environments. Standing at 5 feet 8 inches and weighing around 125 pounds, the robot walks with a smoother, more stable gait due to custom-designed Tesla actuators that provide both power and precision. The most significant hardware improvements are in the hands. While the Gen 2 hand had 11 degrees of freedom, Musk has stated a goal for a new hand with 22 degrees of freedom, approaching the complexity of a human hand. These hands are equipped with tactile sensors, allowing the bot to feel what it is touching and apply appropriate force. This dexterity is crucial for handling varied household objects, a potential demonstrated by the robot handling an egg, though these demos are still performed in controlled settings and often with teleoperation. Third, the foundation, scalable manufacturing. Tesla's core advantage may be its focus on mass production. The company is designing Optimus with large-scale manufacturing in mind, leveraging its existing expertise from vehicle production. Musk has projected that the cost could eventually fall below $30,000 and perhaps as low as $20,000, although this is a long-term target and not a confirmed price. This strategy positions Optimus not as a niche research project but as a future consumer product. The convergence of real-world AI, developing dexterity, and a plan for mass production is the formula intended to unlock widespread home automation. If you want to stay informed on how AI and robotics are set to reshape our world, make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications. We are tracking this story as it develops. What is the first task you would want a humanoid robot to handle in your home? Let us know in the comments. 
What could this technology mean for daily life? Let's explore a speculative day in a home with a fully realized next generation Tesla bot. This isn't a description of current capabilities, but rather the tangible future these technologies are aiming for. A future day might start with Optimus in the kitchen preparing coffee. It could do this not by pressing a single button on a smart machine, but by handling a standard coffee maker, grinding beans and pouring water, using its advanced dexterity. While you get ready, the bot could begin chores, such as sorting laundry by color and fabric, a task enabled by its advanced vision system. It could then unload a dishwasher, its four sensitive hands carefully handling fragile glassware. If a spill occurs, the bot's cameras could perceive the mess, identify it as a liquid, and retrieve a cloth to wipe it up. This would represent autonomous, real-time problem solving, a significant step beyond pre-programmed routines. The bot's neural network would allow it to build a dynamic map of your home, navigating around furniture, pets, and other obstacles. In the evening, it could assist with meal preparation by retrieving and dicing ingredients upon request. The goal is for it to eventually learn new recipes by processing cooking videos online. This vision is about reclaiming time by automating the countless small tasks that fill our days. Musk has stated that thousands of Optimus bots are planned for deployment in Tesla factories as a first step, with limited customer availability potentially starting in late 2025 or 2026. Though these timelines are ambitious, the revolution is intended to start in the factory before moving to the home. What is the ultimate goal? This is more than a new appliance. It's a strategic industrial play. Musk has stated he believes the market for Optimus could eventually make Tesla one of the most valuable companies in the world, with a vision aimed at solving labor itself. The primary market is not just the home, it's factories, warehouses, and any role that is unsafe, repetitive, or boring. Tesla plans to be its own first customer, deploying thousands of bots in its factories. This creates a feedback loop. Robots build products, and the data from their work improves the AI, making them better at their jobs. However, the path forward faces significant challenges. It's important to note that many public demos are still teleoperated or performed in highly controlled environments. Achieving robust, full autonomy in unpredictable real-world settings is an immense engineering hurdle, and skepticism about the project's hype is warranted. Dexterity, while improving, still has a long way to go to replicate the nuance of human touch for all tasks. There are also immense computational requirements to run the AI locally on the bot, as well as unresolved safety and ethical questions. Ensuring a powerful, autonomous robot is safe in a home with children is a critical test. Competition is also a major factor. Companies like Figure AI are already deploying their robots in real-world settings, such as a BMW manufacturing plant, to gain practical experience. Boston Dynamics, backed by Hyundai, continues to set the standard for dynamic mobility. While test Tesla has unique advantages in AI and manufacturing scale, its success is not guaranteed. We are on the cusp of a potential new era in automation. The current landscape of disconnected smart devices may be replaced by something far more integrated, an intelligent, general-purpose assistant. The development of the Tesla bot represents a convergence of three key forces. An AI trained on real-world data, a body with developing near-human dexterity, and a manufacturing plan designed for global scale. The pace of progress is notable, and the implications are significant. Musk has stated an ambitious goal of having thousands of robots working in Tesla factories in 2025, with tens of thousands planned for the following year. The question is no longer if a robot will one day be able to perform household chores. The recent breakthroughs suggest this is becoming an engineering probability. The real questions are, how quickly will this technology mature? And are we as a society prepared for a world where physical labor is no longer exclusively human? That future may be arriving faster than many anticipate.